Welcome Cowboys and YouTubers. It's that VA Dallas Cowboy fan coming back at you one more time today. Because as I was uploading my video for the day about Dallas Cowboys training camp, as it was uploading, I saw the breaking news that defensive tackle Jared McCoy was cut, wave, injured from the team. And I was shocked. And I had to think back, like, why would they do that? pulled that trigger so suddenly when you got him on a three-year 15 million dollar deal that's not really hurting the team and Stephen Jones has talked about yeah well we'll bring him back next season if he's healthy and I'm like hmm that's kind of Stephen speak for it. we ain't bringing him back and I'm trying to think like what's the reasoning behind y'all cutting somebody who was tweeting right before surgery how he's uh, hoping the team is going to win a championship this year and how he's going to help mentor the young guys on the sidelines during the season and now he's just out and out gone like what could be the reasoning and I had to think back and I thought oh yeah he's one of the very few cowboys who called out Jerry Jones about why he was silent through the whole social injustice part of this summer and uh, he kept criticizing Jerry for being silent for all those months after the draft and I think that might have had a little bit to do with it when he was the first one to speak out and uh, I, I made a video and said that it seems kind of odd for you being new and fresh to the team to be calling out your new team owner for stuff like this uh, you as a player and as a person have the right to say stuff like that but business wise it was not a wise move to call out somebody who pays your bills and I think it just backfired on them they, they were willing to tolerate him as long as he was healthy but as soon as something happened to him they were so quick to cut him and I think that's one of the reasons it's crazy but that's just my theory uh you're more than willing to share your opinion. I'd like to hear it. But that's just my running theory right now is that he opened his mouth one too many times against a new owner, a powerful team owner such as Jerry Jones, and now you're gone as soon as you get hurt. And they had no qualms about cutting you after your surgery. That's, I mean, we've seen it before. A couple seasons ago, they cut Alan Hearns after he had surgery and was looking for a comeback after he uh, broke his ankle in that Seattle playoff game. As soon as he was healthy and they were looking at getting him back for training camp, they just cut him. Simple as that. Uh, he was one of those players who also kind of, you know, talked about the play calling with Scott Linehan and you see he got injured and they had no problems cutting him as soon as they saw fit I, I don't know I, I see it's a Stephen Jones move but I think Jerry still has final call on these things and that's just shocking to me but uh that's just my running theory uh you can share yours VA Dallas Cowboy fan out